D Amazing here bringing you a review of the Micro Yamaguchi Mini Revolve Tech War Machine 008. Nope, 6. I was wrong. You guys were right. But yeah, 006. So here I am to bring you a review of the War Machine. Honestly, it's my favorite one so far. Um, War Machine, they tend to do always better than Iron Man. They're just always done better. And I think uh, everyone knows it. It's the better of the two. But anyway, outside of that, we're gonna go around and just kick it into what's going on with it. As you can see, War Machine is highly detailed. Like his SH Figure Arts counterpart, his Revolve Tech regular counterpart, even his Marvel Legends counterpart. War Machine has always done really well from head to toe. These are actually connected, but you can you can take them well, you can take them out, but I would prefer not to. It's on a really hard ball joint where if you don't use hot water, it's going to be a pain in the butt to actually put back. So yeah. Aside from that, let's get into articulation. So, much like Iron Man, he has all sorts of points of articulation. The turret gun on the back is on a ball joint that can go up, down, left, right, A, B, start, you know, things like that. Really enjoying the head scope on one machine. It's so well done. But unlike his SH Figuarts counterpart and his Marvel Legends counterpart, he does not have the two turret missile launches that pop up that you can swap parts for. As far as head articulation, you can actually rotate 360 degrees. Now that you would want to do that, it's on a very fine ball joint. It can go up and down. It even has for flight posing. As far as the arms, it goes up a pretty good distance. They double joint it. These guns cannot be removed, so just so you guys know, you don't have to worry about that. These shoulder pads would not flop up and down because for the Micro Yamaguchi, they said, screw it, we're not going to do that. As far as ab crunch, it has really good forward ab crunch. Probably the best I've seen in the Micro Yamaguchi outside of Kiniko Man, who obviously has the best because a wrestler needs to do these kind of things. Knee joints are pretty good. Double joint it, but because the armor is so bulky... You'll clearly see that you can't go too far. And very, very good ankle support. To rotate the joint, you got to play around it a bit. Like I always say with Revolve Tech joints, you got to just mess with it. Now, as far as hands go, one machine comes with a salute hand. Both left and right. So you can salute America as much as you'd like. He also comes with open force palm hands. There are no effect parts for the hands, but these open palms are really cool and I really do enjoy them. Bonus side, War Machine does come with three tiny little effect parts. My only gripe here with the effect parts is they came out orange to reflect machine gun fire, which is great. But if you're one of those guys ooh, excuse me, who really, really gets ticked off and wants to see what's in the box, as you can see, they're clearly yellow on the box. So some people are going to freak out about that. I prefer them being orange because I like comic book orangey effects. I think it's cool. Don't judge me. Or do judge me. Whatever. Anyway, back to War Machine. War Machine, Sandy Handley, in my opinion, is the best outside of Kaneko Man in terms of articulation and movement and just overall coolness. I've really been enjoying the figure a lot. Um, it makes me actually go back and get Iron Man again so I can screw around with it. But uh, I decided I would wait for War Machine, and I, I honestly do not regret it. War Machine, in my opinion, is a perfect 10 out of 10. It is a perfect 3 and a quarter inch figure. It is way better than the Marvel Universe. It's really cheap if you guys cannot afford the SH Figarts. And if you're one of those guys who's just getting into it, this is a great way to break in and just really enjoy a solid figure. Hands down, just a solid figure. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know. I'm just going to continue to play around with War Machine, and you guys can be jealous. <laughs> nah, but thanks again, guys. Always appreciate it. Thank you.